FNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, everyone. Basil Chapman here for the 1 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. The Dow is now up 55 at 35,180 at 1 o'clock Eastern Time. It hit 36,578. That's 100 points off the most recent high on the 1st of August. And this is a characteristic I'm going to talk about in the next hour. Um, Larry's uh, voice is uh, give, troubling him. So I said, I'm, I'm around. I'm going to, I'll am gonna. i be able to step in for this hour. Um, and I'm going to show you this particular chart. We'll discuss it in great detail. And this is the 914 period moving averages. I know Larry never talks moving averages. So this will be fascinating for those of you who have not uh, listened to um, me before. Now, a couple of things I'll be looking at here is the nine period moving average for the Dow is still positive. But have a look at this. I'll do this with my charts. On the left side chart is a daily Here's the weekly, here's the monthly. This is now the S&P. Look at this, pink. Nine period moving average for two days now, negative. Dow's up, uh, the S&P's up seven to 44.74. Ran all the way to 4.527 this morning. QQQ, NDX 100, uh, up 94 cents at 3.68. Ran all the way to 3.74. Red, pink, uh, nine period moving average. IWM, the Russell 2000. <laughs> Finally flipped to negative, uh, down 68 at 190.90. Look at gold. Gold is trading uh, up to at 1953. That left side area, the 1940s, from um, early in July, beginning of July, that's where I think we're headed. That's going to be the big test for gold. Dollar is not participating too well. It's down 17 ticks at 102 to 34. It's holding very nicely, but it's not actually leading to the, leading to the upside. High-grade copper, high-grade copper. There we go. Uh, down 0 0.02 at 376. Looking at crude oil, it's had a fantastic run. It's uh, now turned down. It's down $1.23 at uh, 83.18. Um, I'm going to talk about that as well when we return. And look at this, the TLT. The TLT is pulling back. 46 cents at 96.74. There was a chance that we got a Chapman Wave volume price climax reversal on um, on the 3rd uh, of May. But in fact, I, I, looking at it, oh, sorry, 3rd of August, looking at it very closely, it just didn't meet all the criteria. I'll be back. I'll be doing Larry's hour. Larry's voice is not well. I'll be back in a moment. Hope you can stand.